Welcome back! In this part we are going to design and code our final window shown at the end of the game. This one. This is the window that we are going to work on. So let's get to it. First we need to open our window final XAML. Okay, as always we start with modifying the window properties and removing the necessary stuff. So for example I won't need any of these okay and this one too we don't actually need a title here but let's leave it as it is now height will be 250 and width will be 400 now resize mode will be no resize and window start application will be center owner and window style will be none let's use our font family so back colon two forward slashes application colon three commas then forward slash hash and kv1 okay now let's increase the default font size to 30 and let's allow transparency set it to true and set background to transparent okay now inside of it we will use a double border it's the same as in window um, menu so let's just copy it up to here so grid row definitions then grid and two borders okay so inside of it we are going to have um, four rows the first three will be auto height so set the height to auto the last one will occupy the rest of the space now the first row will be a title border so we'll use border in grid row zero its name will be header it's important because we are going to change the border based on whether we lost or won. Set border brush to be hash FF00B5C5. Now set the border thickness to be 5. Then set corner radius to be 10. Then we will set the background to light green okay and we'll need some bottom margin five will be enough good inside of it we will have a stack panel with margin of 10 on sides and inside this stack panel we are going to have a text block so again we will access it from code so we need to give it a name set it to tblc and result the default text will be um you won set its um, horizontal al alignment to be center and set font weight to be bold okay um, let's set width to auto if it matters in the second row we will have a grid so grid row one inside of it we will have two columns the first one will have auto width and the second one will occupy the rest of the space in the left column we will have a text block set it grid column zero set its text to be final then we need our hard character I think we can find it in user control game 
while yeah here okay so final happiness colon and space then we will have another textbook in grid column one and we will access it from code so let's give it a name let it be tblc final the text will be the same in the third row we will have a text block set it to grid row 2 its name will be tblc comment and the text will be the same because we will set it from code and in the fourth and our final row we will have a button set its grid row to three um it will need a click event okay um set its content to be a tick which we can get from user control game here okay good and let's limit its width to 75 okay good so we can save it now in our code uh, in the constructor after we initialize it we will set text block final text to be um, our happiness okay and then we simply check if happiness is greater or equals 100 then we access our settings and default and we need wins so we assign this setting the same value plus one so convert it to int then settings default actually we could just copy it and plus one okay and then we need call the save method to save our settings then we will assign the result text to be um, year one okay and tblc common text will be just excellent okay else if happiness is less than 100 then we don't need to save or modify any settings instead first of all we will access our header which is a border and we will access its background and set it to brushes coral okay the result will be you lost and the comment will be your pet is set okay and also when we click this button we just need to close this window and what happens afterwards is processed in our user control game so let's check it first we will win to see this green border and then we will lose and if everything goes as expected we should see the coral brush let's lose yeah you see you lost our final happiness and the comment your pet is set now let's win this game so um,
And you see you won. Final happiness 107. Excellent. At last we have completely recreated the game that you had seen in the introduction video. Nevertheless, there will be a few more to bring to life suggestions that I have received while making these tutorials. I plan to improve button style, refactor code, create a separate class for a pet that will be passed between user controls instead of separate variables. And finally, we will develop a load save mechanics in which we will use the new class as well. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to see more tutorials.